do you still find the same humor in the afterlife? Last time we reached out to a comedy legend, the energy in the room was like no other, and also came with a few surprises. Uh, I've been writing this thing for years to travel. Today, we're reaching out to another comedy legend, Bernie Mac. And if you're a fan of either Bernie or comedy, you're not going to want to miss this. If there's anybody who can help us get through to Bernie Mac, please assist us tonight. We're trying to reach out to Bernie Mac. Bernie, can you hear us? Bernie, your fans miss you so, so much. Your fans are hoping to hear from that trademark humor that you always brought, Bernie. I can feel the connection starting to become established now. Bernie, it's been a while since your passing. Can you first start by coming through and just telling us what it's like for you on the other side? Have you seen any familiar faces or family? How do you feel about the current state of comedy today? I know you had a unique style of comedy that uh, your fans just loved. Soul. We actually just did a session with uh, Tupac Shakur. I'm not sure if you if you know him or have hit, heard his music, but uh, he just came through talking about uh, today's rap and saying that today's rap lacks a lot of that soul. What's your take on the current state of rap? <laughs> Bernie, I'm sure there's way more on the other side than there is here, but what do you miss the most about Earth? And while we're on the topic of talking about Earth and your life here, do you still watch over your family that still hasn't made it to the other side yet with you? Do you miss them, Bernie? What are your thoughts on uh, the current social and political climate? The world is a totally different place nowadays with so much happening. Bernie, you always had an amazing stage presence. How did you build that? something about your grandma, I think. Did she contribute a lot to your success, Bernie? Was she a big inspiration? She Bernie, do correct me if I'm wrong, but from what I understand, you've always been about tough love. Do you have any wisdom or knowledge that you can share to the world about love? because I saw this actually in a comment that one of your fans left us. I'm not sure if this is a quote that you used to say, but uh, can you tell us what does the phrase mean, spare the rod uh, and spoil the child? What does that mean, Bernie? Where did that come from? Oh, 
thank you, Bernie. Your fans are gonna appreciate this so much. I know that you were also an actor and you had uh, your own TV show. Did you enjoy acting as much as you enjoyed stand-up? Were there ever shows or, uh, or roles that you uh, turned down that you nowadays wish you hadn't? Bernie, who was your favorite comedian growing up? I remember hearing you say that you wanted to be a comedian ever since you were a young boy. Bernie, if you could go back in time, what's the one thing that you'd tell young Bernie Mac if you could? And Bernie, if you could, do you have any advice for any aspiring comedians that wish to follow your path? Has your style of humor changed in the afterlife, Bernie? Still Bernie, but I'm going to go You loved performing and you loved comedy clubs. Are there still comedy clubs in the afterlife, Bernie? Everywhere's a club. You make a laugh. I know there's a lot of, uh, what is it called? Sorry. There's a lot of uh, misinformation about the afterlife and rules that may be there on the other side. Bernie, do you still get to crack jokes in the afterlife? Your show, the uh, the Bernie Mac show, was groundbreaking. Do you have any thoughts on how it's remembered, or how you'd like your fans to remember it? Are you still watching the reruns from your old shows up there, Bernie? Bernie, you were always about that bass in your voice. Has that changed at all in the afterlife? Bernie, you had a talent and an ability for making everyday situations funny. Do you still find the same humor in the afterlife? You had a special way of connecting with people from all walks of life. Do you have any advice on that? We've had a lot of spirits come through over time now talking about their sense of time in the afterlife. Can you tell us, is there a sense of time in the afterlife, Bernie? Bernie, do you remember your first ever big break in comedy? I was wondering, Bernie, what went through your mind back then when you stepped foot on that stage? What's your take on political correctness in comedy, Bernie? I know you had some strong opinions when you were here about that.
Have you met any uh, fellow comedians up there, Bernie? Bernie, your I ain't scared of you routine was legendary. Do you still feel that fearless in the afterlife? Before we start to close up the session, Bernie, do you have any final words for your fans or the world watching? Wow, what an amazing session. Bernie Mac is still the king of comedy and is still inspiring us from the other side. Thank you all so much for being a part of this incredible journey. Leave your thoughts down below and let us know who you'd like to see us get in contact with next. Until then, stay blessed and keep laughing.